Long awaited improvements to fix a railroad crossing is causing a headache for some in Hernando County, but not everyone is happy about the fix. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane is taking action tonight to get an answer to their biggest concern. Thousands of vehicles use Highway 50 every day to get to I-75 from Brooksville. Now it's going to be closed for a month and people in downtown Brooksville aren't very happy about the rerouted traffic. It's just out of control. Lee Golanello is talking about the traffic just a couple of steps outside of her business in downtown Brooksville. I mean truck after truck after truck. I counted over 50 of them hauling through here between 50 and 60 miles an hour. The Highway 50 bypass closed Monday to start a 30 day project to fix the railroad tracks that have been needed fixed for a long time. It's just really bumpy, like you would have to merge over to the left lane to go on the good side. Traffic that normally takes the highway is funneling through the narrow streets of downtown Brooksville. Pedestrian parking all over the streets. You can't even open your door. I mean, I went to open my, my truck door and I couldn't open my door because the trucks wouldn't stop. Though William Singer says when the detour started on Monday, it was one of the busiest Mondays the downtown coffee shop has seen in a while. I think people are getting lost and they're wondering here, which is good. We'll take it. But Gallinello says there needs to be more law enforcement to maintain the 35 mile per hour speed limit, especially with all the pedestrian traffic. Uh, somebody's going to get hurt. Somebody's going to step out of their car and get run over. It's really creating a dangerous situation and there's nobody out here. We reached out to Brooksville Police Department who says they will step up traffic monitoring in this area. In Brooksville, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.